Traveling by helicopter is incredible. It's fast, it's more versatile than a plane, and generally a little comfier. No wonder more and more celebrities are buying them. But just like their winged counterparts, helicopters don't come cheap. And they can get incredibly fancy. Just ask the head of any state or celebrities such as Harrison Ford and Madonna. And if you thought helicopters are reserved for rescue missions and flying cargo to natural disaster hit areas, then think again. The helicopters we're about to show you have full bathrooms, lounge areas, a kitchen, and several other impressive features such as granite flooring, crocodile leather, and gold accents. Helicopters come in all shapes and sizes, and also with different price tags. And much like with cars, you can get your sedans, 4x4s, and your super fancy turbocharged Ferrari type models. It just depends on what you want to use it for, and of course, how far your budget can be stretched. The sky truly is the limit. Let's have a look at the 5 most expensive helicopters in the world. Let's see what they have to offer, what makes them so special, and what they're used for. Our list starts with the very reasonably priced Bell 525. Considered to be a super medium class of luxury helicopters, this one will set you back a mere 15 million US dollars. Not that much money, considering the most expensive one on our list will set you back almost twice this amount. Sometimes referred to as the Relentless, the Bell 525's exterior is sleek and distinctive, and the interior has a generous amount of space and tons of exciting amenities. While it can be customized to suit the owner's needs, the Bell 525 comes standard with a Garmin G5000H avionic touchscreen, uses a fly-by-wire control system, and has a range of 575 miles. This ride seats up to 20 passengers and was engineered for optimal safety and comfort. Inside the cabin looks like a high-end boardroom complete with plush seating and an ultra-modern look. We guess you can liken it to the inside of a limousine, only the Bell 525 has swivel seats and a mini galley. Its cabin size also comes in at 88 square feet. Next up is the slightly more expensive Airbus H215 Super Puma, priced at 15.5 million US dollars. This bad boy can carry up to 19 passengers and be customized to the max. And by that, we mean you can make it look like a little apartment. Different designs in the past have included a lounge, full bathroom, kitchen, and even in-flight entertainment all of which might just be needed, seeing that it has a range of 522 miles. It also has a top speed of 156 miles per hour. Not bad, right? Size-wise, the cabin's interior has a height of 4.82 feet, a width of 5.9 feet, and a length of 15 feet. But if that's not enough space for you, maybe we can interest you in the Sikorsky S92? This helicopter comes with enough space for 19 passengers though each person will have a lot more room. The Sikorsky S92 measures in at 68.6 .6 feet long, 17.3 feet wide, and 15.5 feet high. It will cost you quite a bit though, like 17.7 .7 million US dollars. And this is only the standard model. The company also produces a VIP model. Seeing that space definitely isn't an issue, this helicopter comes standard with a bathroom, galley, and even closet space. Custom options include beefed up exterior armor, satellite phones, and advanced monitoring systems. Because if you have 17.7 .7 million US dollars to spend, you might as well max out your budget. The presidents and heads of state of more than 10 countries around the world have chosen the Sikorsky S92 as an official mode of transportation because of its great safety features and spaciousness. The Augusta Westland AW101 makes all of the ones we've just mentioned look like entry-level helicopters. It comes with a pretty hefty price tag of 21 million US dollars. But let's face it, if you're in the market for a helicopter, then you obviously have a budget for it, right? So you might as well go all out. While the Augusta Westland is mainly used within the military and government realms, it isn't unheard of for it to be owned by private companies and entities. It has enough seating space for 24 passengers and enough overall room for people to walk around in upright and with no discomfort at all. The AW101 has been tested and proven to be safe and resilient in all types of environments, including the Antarctic and the Arctic circles. While it can also be customized, its standard interior design is far less flashy than the others we've mentioned. 
However, since it has been proven to be such a popular buy among the world's VIP population, Augusta Westland also produces a luxury version. Its price is available on demand only, so you know it doesn't come cheap. Not that it's anything compared to the one we're about to show you next. But before we tell you more, remember to hit the like and subscribe buttons. Coming in at an unthinkable 27 million US dollars, the Airbus H225 Super Puma really is the creme de la creme of helicopters. And guess what? There's only one out there that's even pricier. Stick around and we'll tell you all about it. The H225 is suitable for just about any purpose you can imagine. And though it's a bit slower than the other rides in its class, the H225 has enough features to make up for it. Being incredibly popular with wealthy executives, the H225's cabin is super comfortable and the customization options appear to be endless. Space is not a problem either. The cabin height comes in at 4.76 feet, its length measures 19.52, and it has a width of 5.9 feet. That is a lot of room. However, it's not only the rich and famous that use this helicopter. They are a favorite within the offshore drilling industries and even search and rescue crews make use of them. Apart from official uses, presidential and business magnet clients, quite a few celebrities are becoming fans of traveling by helicopter. For instance, Harrison Ford. This veteran actor not only pilots the Millennium Falcon as Han Solo, but in real life he is also an accomplished pilot. He is one of the many celebrities who are starting to prefer helicopters over planes. Madonna is another seasoned helicopter traveler. No, she doesn't fly them herself, but she prefers them to planes. Not only is she still busy as a music industry icon, but as a mom and a goodwill ambassador for child welfare for the country of Malawi. She sure needs to get around. And when she does, Madonna can often be spotted getting on board a private helicopter. In fact, according to Just Jared, the music legend is known for taking her children on helicopter rides when they go on vacation. Another humanitarian celebrity who loves to ride in helicopters is Angelina Jolie. Much like the Material Girl, when she has to travel in her capacity as a special envoy to the United Nations High Commissioner for Refugees, she prefers to do so via private helicopter. And finally, how about the most expensive helicopter in the world? We've already told you all about the Sikorsky S92 standard model, but what about the VIP model? Its price varies depending on exactly how you customize it, but they generally don't go for less than 32 million US dollars. It does at least come standard with noise suppression, so you won't only be able to feel the comfort of the money you've spent, but you'll also be able to enjoy it in silence. Some of the other features you'll find standard is an air conditioning system and life rafts, as well as an emergency floating system. When Sikorsky first started making the VIP configuration, an unknown client commissioned one that would make history. The first fully customized Sikorsky S92 had its interior designed by a Canadian firm called Flying Colors. They installed a granite floor in the cabin area. It's a first for helicopter interiors. The extravagance didn't exactly stop there though. The cabin is fitted with dramatic blue insets of synthetic crocodile leather and offset with white leather seats, with sky blue accents complementing the oval cabin windows. Club seating arrangements accommodate four passengers up front and five in the back. The blue theme is carried through to the side walls, with white leather accented by blue stingray patterned leather above the crocodile leather inserts below. Additionally, there are custom woodwork finishes in high gloss deep blue, metal fittings and seat buckles are finished in satin gold, and a plush blue carpet completes the design. The project took about 4 months to complete. If you could choose between traveling by plane or helicopter, which one would you go for?